Columbine Project, to me, I guess uh, from the aspect of the play, is uh, an important uh, educational tool, I feel, uh, that people should see and remember, especially high schoolers, middle schoolers. Columbine Project means a lot to me, uh, actually so much that uh, I'm going to be moving to New York. Um, I'm throwing everything I've got into this. I'm actually from Colorado. I just knew that this was something I had to be a part of. I think it's uh, a huge part of American history and our culture, and I hope that, you know, some little piece of it can somehow affect someone that it can make a positive change in the world. The Columbine Project uh, has meant a lot more to me than I would have ever imagined. What's been most amazing to me is how everyone came together and how every single person in the cast has treated this subject with the respect that it deserves. I was able to connect uh, parts of myself with Eric and I guess things that the character was interested in, I was able to tie in some of those elements that I'm interested in that we, we kind of overlap with things that we dislike or that we like and I uh, was able to mesh the two. The book uh, that her, that Rachel's parents wrote, called Rachel's Tears, was essentially my Bible. They included a lot of her writings, and I think that really brought a reality to her. So I just, I used that a lot. I write in a journal, actually in the journal that I use on stage every performance before the show. And that's probably my most consistent, uh, therapy. <laughs> I'm a personal at Columbine High School. We have a student in our building with a gun that is we are on the way. How in the hell can you go around making pipe bombs? Now, Columbine is very important to me. I have to tell you about it. Well, I think I think the show does a great job of trying to show what the parents thought, what the kids thought, everybody's involvement, the police, everything, and I think that you really have to take the time to look at the situation all the way. You can't just jump in and make a decision. And it was just really a traumatic experience, and that was two nights ago. And come here and have my emotion drawn out again. It's, uh... show as much as possible because it's the, the story is very important and needs to be told as much as possible. I'm just very proud to watch people come together and give so much of themselves to tell an honest story about something that's so important in the world. All of mine going off Broadway, uh, very excited. I mean there was lots of uh, is it gonna happen, is it not gonna happen at the beginning. I kind of had an underlying feeling the whole time that there was more to it than what had happened here in Los Angeles. So, uh, my excitement's been spread out over the course of like two months. <laughs> Obviously, I'm so excited to be going to New York. It almost just feels like it kind of just fell together. And I, I hope that, that it affects people there the way it has here.